Okay, y'all, we're back. Um, I just want to go over the brushes and um, the use for them. Um, this here is a kabuki brush. Um, and this is for people who don't know anything about brushes. If you have a video that you already have done about brushes, all my makeup sisters out there who have already done tutorials and many videos, please go in and attach it to this one by all means. Because I don't believe one person has the corner of the market on everything. We all have something to say, okay? And it's room for all of us. That's why they made that video response. Just slide yours on up in there. All right? Okay. This right here is a kabuki brush. I love this brush. I got this brush from Sephora.com, but you don't have to get it from Sephora.com. I heard the one that Avon has right now is the business. So here you go. See that? I got a little bit of powder in it. I'm sorry. But Jaleesa, this is a kabuki brush. And this is used for your blush or your bronzer. And right now, I'm just going to use it for my bronzer. And I'll put a little bit of my bronzer like down in there and hit it like right up under there. Because that's usually where like the light hit or whatever. When you're using blush though, I just use the blush for my cheeks. Okay? So that there is your kabuki brush. Now. Woo! You got to go back, sweetie, and watch my brush. Watch my um video. Look, I don't even have it in here. I keep it in a I keep it in a um a tomb. Cause that's how much I'm a, a, a cherish and keep that book, that $28 MAC brush. Yeah, that thing is in lockup for safekeeping because uh, it'll never happen again unless it's a birthday present or something. Uh, that's what that's how I'll be getting my MAC brushes from now on through birthdays and Christmas. Okay, all right, so I'm sorry, y'all. Anyway, I'm gonna put these over here so I don't want to get in the way, but. I have found, and I'm not saying that this is the end all to the be all, because it could be some other brush that comes out that I might like, and then I'll be getting up on here saying that that's the greatest thing. So, <laughs> this is the greatest thing right now to me. When I found this particular brush at Walgreens, they are Studio 35 Beauty Brushes. This is an eye blending and smudging brush. Okay, I even have, look, I got two of them still in the package and I got two that are out because I use them every day. They are my favorite, favorite, all time favorite brushes. Okay, because you got the blending on this side and that's nice, right? And you know what I like about two sided brushes? If you're not a person who wears makeup like all the time and you just put it on in the morning and that's it for work. They're nice because you could do two in one. A little bit of powder in that one too. But you could do two in one and you can save yourself a lot of money. Because you could buy this brush and do your whole, all of this. And then blend with this side and be done. The only thing you would have to do is clean it. You know, to get the powder out. Every now and then if you're going to use the same one. But I would suggest probably that you had like two of them. Just so you could like switch up. But these are my favorite. I use these every day. So again, this is your smudge which, which can get here. Alright. This is your blending which can blend here. So I bought um, a palette in so that I can show you. Smudge. And I use that for here. Y'all hear that phone ringing? It never fails. Alright, and I use that for right in here, okay? So, when I put larger, now Miss Butterfly turned me onto this brush. I ran and got it, okay? This is the Smoky Wide um, Double Edge 
by Essence of Beauty and you can get this from CVS. I think it was like $5.99, something like that. But um, I use this for when I'm doing. I'm so glad I brought this in here so I could show you because it's nothing like showing somebody how to do something. But when I want to go like all up and through here, all up and through here and get a nice little um, thing going on there. And that also can be used for down in here. But I love that. And then you, so that's the smoky wide. So you can get that one once you get more into, or you can run and get it tomorrow. Do what you want to do, baby. Do you. All right. So then you just go in there with that, blend it all in, and that's it. Then I have several, like, blush brushes. This is nice. This is um, a Sonia Kashi. Ooh, love it. I got this from, look at that. I got this from um, Target. Look at that. Her brushes are beautiful and so soft. Very little, if any, fallout. Like, I'm doing this now and I haven't had any fallout. This is awesome for your blushes. Again, I have the bronzer in here, so I'll just use that. This is awesome for your light, and it gives you like a nice light um, blush going on, right? And then I have several other um, blush brushes. I don't remember where I got these from, but these are powder brushes as well. See? These are powder brushes. This right here, this is um, a buffing brush. That brush with the flat top. Now some people use it to put their foundation on. Some people use it now. I like it for buffing out um, when I use concealer. I like it for buffing out concealer. And this is like pretty rough. I got this from Big Lots when they were having that sale. And it's a lot of fallout. So this is like a horrible one. But that's what these are for. These flat tops um, are for. I use it to buff out. Then you get into your, these are just regular um, shadow brushes. Let me put these over here. These are just regular shadow brushes. This, not, this might be like a little long. I'm going to try to edit it as much as I can, but I really want Jaleesa to get, this is really for you, baby, um, the deal. Now, this is my e.l.f. brush. These are 99 cents. You can get them from drugstore.com. You don't have to wait for e.l.f. to take an eternity to send it to you. Then here's the thing with e.l.f. When you order from ELF, you have to order with no expectation of getting it for a while. And that's the key to that. I mean, the stuff is um, reasonable. Everything's about a dollar. But just order it and go somewhere and sit down. Because it's going to be a minute before you get it in the mail. That's You don't order from them and then look every day trying to figure out when it's going to come. It's going to be a minute. Alright? So that I tell you all that. So then this here... You just go in here with that. So you can use this for that. Oh girl. And watch that. See? Thank you, Jaleesa, for making this request. I am loving this. Alright. And then you have like your little angle brushes. See how this is like on an angle? I use this for when I'm doing my foundation and all of that. I use that, I go right up under here, right up under here with my, with this brush right here. Or you could do it with this up the side if you just want a nice, even, alright? So that's what that's for. Then you get into your, here's a crease brush. This is a crease brush. I wish I had known where I got these. It had to be from like Target. These are collection. So if anybody knows where they sell these, because I don't know, it's been a while. It's the name is collection. Though. But here's a crease brush, sweetie. And see, that's like really nice. I love these. I use them all the time. And then you like, this is for this part right here. See, right here in your crease. It's made to get right up in there. For the hip liner and stuff like that. Or you could use these to like kind of get in there or like people use them to line. Alright. Here with that. These are the thick ones. Then you have your concealer brushes. 
They're considered like paint brushes. And I use these for um, concealer to put them on and dab them on different spots. And I also use these for cream shadows. When I'm putting on cream shadows. I didn't bring any cream shadow in here with my stuff. So that's this week and I hope that this has um, helped you out some. And I am off to do a vlog because I really want to talk about something. So y'all look for that. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. I ain't going to talk about nothing too bad. But um, hope this helps. And thank you as always. And keep the requests coming. And I got a couple more that I'm going to do. So I'm really loving this. See y'all later.